Babe Ruth once said, heroes get remembered, but legends never die. After World War I ending in 1918 and the Black Sox scandal in 1919, America needed a person to look up to who wasn't in politics. You could say that that man who did this was Babe Ruth, a star baseball player and the first modern celebrity changed the idea of sports superstars and figures forever. George Herman Ruth Jr. was born to George Herman Ruth Sr. and Katherine Schamberger on February 6, 1895. He was born in Baltimore, Maryland. He was one of the eight children born to his family, but only he and one of his sisters survived. He was a troubled kid, always messing around and skipping school. So this led to him being sent to St. Mary's Industrial School for Boys. He would meet Brother Matthias and develop his love for the game of baseball. He would work frequently on his hitting, pitching, and fielding skills. He would be recognized for his skills and receive a contract from the Baltimore Orioles. Ruth was only with the Orioles for a short time before he was called up to the Boston Red Sox. Babe Ruth would end up being a pitcher for the Boston Red Sox and would later be an outfielder in his career. Over the next five years, Babe Ruth led the Red Sox to three championships and one game where he pitched 13 scoreless innings. In December of 1919, Babe Ruth would sign with the New York Yankees for $100,000, which is the equivalent of $1,500,000 in 2021. In 1920, his first year with the New York Yankees, he hit 54 home runs. The next season, he would break his own record by hitting 59. He would end up playing for the New York Yankees from 1920 to 1934 and play for the Boston Braves in 1935 and officially retire. He would end up leading the league in home runs 12 times in his career and ended with 714 home runs, which would be the MLB best until 1974 when Hank Aaron of the Atlanta Braves passed him. By this time, Babe Ruth was starting to get old and was starting to consider retirement. On May 25, 1935, an overweight and diminishing Babe Ruth would hit three home runs in a single game at Forbes Field in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. The following week, he officially announced his retirement from baseball. He was one of the first five players inducted to the Baseball Hall of Fame in 1936. The other four Hall of Fame members were Ty Cobb, Walter Johnson, Christy Mathewson, and Hannes Wagner. The reason that I believe Babe Ruth belongs in the Hall of Fame is not because he was just a superstar baseball player. He was the first modern celebrity. He was also a movie star, a vaudeville performer, a barnstormer, a pitchman for every conceivable product, and a national syndicated newspaper columnist. He was the first celebrity of the mass media era. Another reason that Babe Ruth was important is because of the advancement of technology in today's world. Back in the 1920s, it was very hard to listen or to watch Babe Ruth. Tom Stanton, a baseball historian and author, once said, it's difficult to convey to people today just how popular of a sports figure Babe Roy was in American history. He's the most mythical figure in American sports history and a huge icon. Of all the colorful figures that existed during the 1920s and 1930s, Babe was at the front of the line. Babe Ruth sadly passed away in 1948, but his legacy still lives on. Shortly before he died, he created the Babe Ruth Foundation, which gives money to poor and needy children. But when he died, a lot of his money went to this foundation, and there continues to still be money going into the foundation. In 2018, he was awarded the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Babe Ruth didn't fight in any wars or go into politics, but he is one of the main reasons why sports are so popular. Without Babe Ruth, who knows how popular sports would be. Babe Ruth was a person to look up to that was not in politics and was entertaining to listen and to watch play baseball. His legacy will always be remembered by people who grew up in the 1920s 
and they will tell stories of him being the first modern celebrity from generation to generation.